What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back to some Satisfactory. That's right, we have update three upon us. And with that, we are now in the experimental build because that is where they pushed it. They pushed it in the experimental build. So they actually, I was reading through the patch notes, they actually changed quite a bit of stuff. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to start a new game, and we're going to go to this new deserty area. Absolutely, this is going to be Z dessert. Yes, because that sounds absolutely delicious, hopefully. Uh, enable to skip the onboarding process and start the game at tier one. <gasps> ooh, ooh, do we want to do that? I think we should, because that's really basic stuff. That's like the most basic of the basic stuff. Let's do it. We're going to do it. Updating progress. Fantastic. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. If you guys are curious about Satisfactory, I'll have a link down below. It's on the Epic Games Store. I know it's Epic Games. People you either love it or you hate it. But hey, they shoot a little bit back to creators, so I can't complain. I can't complain. <laughs> All right. So new deserty area. Oh, my gosh. How are we going to get any biomass in here <laughs> whatsoever? <gasps> oh, this is going to be interesting. All right. So. Uh, looks like we have some watery stuff over here. Fantastic. Oh, this looks so cool. There's a slug. We already found a slug, people. I know. It's amazing. Who would have known? Okay. All right. Giant dunes. This looks like a great place. <laughs> this looks like a great place for a base. <laughs> let's go ahead. Let's get one of these out now. Okay. So we already have a bunch of those. Let's go ahead. Let's get hub parts. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and build the hub, shall we? Uh, we'll get that guy placed right there. Fantastic. Ooh. I feel like everything has a fresh coat of paint on it, you know? Okay, space elevator. Oh, actually, I thought they said they changed some things for... Oh, no, I think... Yeah, those are all the same. Structure, biomass, all that fancy fun stuff. Okay, cool, cool. That looks good. That looks good. Anything good in here? No, not really. All right, what about in here? Anything good? All right, base building. So we got some foundations. Oh... There's an eight meter by one by two and by four in a ramp. Okay. Logistic splitter merger conveyor lifter productivity display. You can see the efficiency of each building. Oh my gosh. I was just talking about that. Oh, that's amazing. Now the ma'am, the molecular, the, the molecular, the molecular analysis machine analysis machine is something you actually have to build. What? It doesn't come free. I guess not. And then let's see. Do we have any? What's new in here? Copper sheeting. The assembly. I feel like they changed the how uh, how the machines look. The black and the orange look super nice. I like it. Rotor modular frame. Smart plating. What is smart plating? Oh my gosh. Chainsaw. Solid. What is solid biofuel? There are so many new things here. Oh, I'm super excited. Awesome sink. The awesome shop. Oh, we're going to get into that. Anyways, okay. Enough of the rambling. Let's get things started, shall we? I say so. Now, we have a couple of these uh, these basic machines. Equipment shortcuts. Wait, what? Oh, it doesn't. Okay. It's just saying that you could put that in your hands if you so choose. Fantastic. Okay. So where are the resources at? Oh, there's a resource right there. Let's go ahead and equip this bad boy. Let's do. Let's let's give these guys the shock treatment real quick. Hello. On oh, God. You're too slow. Too slow. Hiya. 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 Oh, you made me take damage. What a jerk. What a jerk. Now, they also said they added the ability. Might shed light on how to increase chances of survival. Okay. All right. Fantastic. Now, they said they also added like crouching and sliding. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love it. 10 out of 10 approved. This Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. I'm aware. It's an edible food. It's a, it's a barrel nut. We all know, we all know what barrel nuts are. All right, so I'm curious. There's this copper bit laying right here. There's not a copper, a copper deposit. Okay. All right, so we got a copper deal here. We'll go ahead and we'll throw our uh, our miners on there. Now, if you guys are curious about like the whole beginning stuff like that, uh, I recommend checking out like my first two videos in the series. It's not specifically over this, however, it is about the same, I believe. Okay, so we're gonna let that do its thing. Uh, let's go ahead and throw out another one right there. You know what? We have a ton of these. Let's just go ahead and get another one, shall we? Absolutely. Fantastic. All right. We have another slug over here. So let's go grab this guy and we'll have to do some researchy stuff with him. Second slug acquired. Now, I have noticed that there it, it, it appears that there's like these tumbleweed looking things. So I'm going to guess that's our going to that's going to be like our uh, biomass fuel source. And there is this little like jungle area thing over here. Oh, there's one over there, like an oasis, if you will. And oh yeah, it's definitely an oasis. There's some water there. 
and there's a whole bunch of like grass and whatnot oh this looks like a great place to build a base you know what we're gonna build it over here we're gonna grab that we're gonna bring it right here all right let's go ahead and put the uh let's put this guy right over here for now looks good fantastic wonderful wonderful there's a slug hiding in there but is this here what super weird to find the ore just like chilling here i like it all right so we got to build this ma'am thing <laughs> wait hold on we have to unlock it first don't we field research we need this oh my we need wire we need screws and plating what and concrete and plate okay so we have plates all right let's just go ahead and drop those in here like a so we'll drop those in there like a so and oh relevant items oh i like that it kind of breaks it down for you very nice so hold on i should have the ability to scan oh wait hold on what's the scan deal now oh okay so i want limestone is there limestone right here oh there's limestone right here fantastic oh it's next to one of these guys awesome let's go ahead and get our uh, our zapper tool out again hello mr dude hey yeah hey yeah oh you jerk you got me twice that's unacceptable all right so what do we have over here we have uh some grass okay uh that's not a lot of grass there <laughs> it's not by any means but we also have water now they added pipes which means that there are items now. And the reason that I didn't want to like jump into another save is that some machines actually require water as an additional source to like, you know, cool the item that you would be running. You know what I mean? So pretty neat. Good gosh, there's slugs everywhere. I love it. All right, let's see. So this guy right here, this is going to be our limestone. We got to get some things. We got to get some, uh, some things automated here quickly. I want to check out the new stuff. <gasps> what is this dude? What's up, little bird? Oh, you can't fly? I'm not going to hurt you, man. Don't worry about it. Don't even fret. Okay, so that guy's getting limestone. We have a bunch of copper over here, but I did realize that equipment shortcuts, these are actually the same items that are down here. So when I had four of the uh, miners up here, I didn't also have four down here. They're kind of, uh, it kind of like prioritizes what it looks like is the, uh, the most useful items that you could possibly be looking for at that time. So I'm probably going to take some of these. I'll probably take one or two. We'll probably take two of them, though, to be honest. Yeah, because like this guy's almost full anyways. So we also need some iron. Let's go ahead and scan for that. Looks like, okay, it looks like we're surrounded by a few. Where's the closest iron deal? I didn't, I didn't see. Is that it right there? That might be it. It's weird because it's not C to scan for that. No. Oh, iron right there. Okay, cool. Awesome. I'm going to go drop one of these on here because I think I have what? Uh, one, two. Oh, I only have two. Hmm. We'll drop one more in here. We'll go throw one on the iron one as well. All right. So one going down on the iron. Fantastic. Now, I'm actually kind of curious. Wait, hold on. No, I want the fantastic. I'm actually kind of curious because it doesn't look like there's as many resources here. So I was expecting these to be probably like pure or of a better quality be just because there's not nearly as many and oh what why is there radiation over here wait what is that is that that's not uranium is oh is that uranium right there no is there uranium nearby oh uh oh we need a shocker deal go on hey yeah uh where hey hey get back here ha 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 beat a nerd uh, what is this? Copper. Okay. Uh, I'm curious. I wonder if there's like a uranium deposit. Oh. <gasps> there's some right there. What? That's super weird. Okay, so that means there must be uranium somewhere nearby. Maybe that would be pretty cool if there was. That way we wouldn't have to go like, you know, all the way back to the other place. All right. So we have some things. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get some things refined. And we're going to get that, uh, the upgrade that we need for the ma'am. Now it's mostly concrete, but that's all right. Cause we have concrete being made currently or not concrete, but we have, we have stuff. All right. This whole doing everything manually is for the birds. <laughs> it's, it's terrible. Okay. So let's get these out of our inventories. Uh, we'll go ahead to get the slug out of the inventory as well. And let's go and check on our limestone over here. Wow. Everything is red. It is super red. Holy redness of red. That's okay. I like it. Let's grab the con let's grab the limestone. Let's turn it into concrete. Let's get this uh let's get this last thing knocked out real quick. I have decided it might be better if we just go ahead and start building some stuff because doing everything by hand is going to take absolutely forever. So, let's go ahead. Let's get some Oh, you know what? <gasps> we don't even have the stuff to 
Oh, we are working on that. We don't even have the stuff to make foundations yet. Oh, this is terrible. All right, we will finish it then, I guess. We'll just, we'll just wait and just, just finish it up. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm literally two concrete away from getting this thing done. Then we can get foundations and then we can start putting foundations down. We got, we've got to start automating some stuff because this, this is just ridiculous. All right, so we have the concrete. We have the stuff we need. Let's go ahead and upload that. Boom, push the button. Fantastic. My gosh, we've done it. All right, foundations. So I'm curious. We have all these new foundations. We have a one meter thick one. Lookout tower. Conveyor pole, some walls, uh, power stuff. Anything else new? Equipment workshop. That da, 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 da. looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Okay. So this requires six. That requires six. And that. Oh man, I was hoping that these ones require less. I think it should be like. I honestly think it should be like one or no. I think it should be like one, three, and six, or like one, six, and nine. You know what I mean? Like make it a little bit less. I really like these one foundations though, because like look how nice and tidy those things are. The only problem is if you use this, you have a little bit of leeway. And if you use this, you have a lot more leeway. Let's go with you know what? Let's use the new stuff. And let's go with some new stuff. And that's all I can build. <laughs> that's it. That's all I can build for now. For now. So I'm going to wait for those to get done. Uh, I'm probably going to go over here, grab the copper, grab the uh, the iron, get those crafted into bars, and then we can come back and then hopefully get some machines going. We got to get some machines going here. All right, so we got the hub moved onto some platforms, but we have got, we've got to make some automation stuff. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to start with that. So I need an auto miner and some plating. Super easy. We'll just grab these two guys. We're going to throw an auto miner on here because I need the concrete so we can make more foundations because like, you have to have foundations. If you don't have foundations, it's not okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? All right, so let's go ahead. Let's get a auto miner right on here. That looks good, fantastic. Okay, and then let's go ahead and get another auto miner. We'll probably put it on the iron one, the copper one. We don't need a lot of copper right away. Um, I do have the current milestone for the field research, which will unlock the MAM. And I know the MAM works differently now. So I definitely want to check that out. I'm trying to get into that as soon as I can here. All right. And then we'll get this guy right on here. Let's get this turned around this way. Fantastic. Okay. So there's one for that. There's one for that. Now we need a constructor. Where's the constructor? Uh, we already have enough for that. Okay, cool. So we're going to put the constructor next to the miner on this guy. Get the concrete being made. So we make more foundations, keep everything nice and pretty. But what's actually kind of cool about this area is that if you build up this is fairly open and there's not a whole lot. So you can just build up over the top of these dunes and you won't have to worry about a whole lot. And it actually kind of gives you the option to build underneath of it and kind of like run your uh, your your lines and stuff like that if you absolutely need to. But we definitely have to get a constructor built. Like I said, we're just going to get it thrown probably right there. That looks good to me. And then we're going to get in the smelter. Actually, you know what? Let's just go ahead and let's get this bad boy connected up. We need this to happen right now. Cannot afford oh, I'm out of metal plating. Can I make I can't make that in my inventory? No, I want to be able to craft in my inventory. All right, so we should be good on that. Let's go ahead and get a power pole in here. What am I missing? A rods? <laughs> oh, power pole, go. Yes. Okay, cool. So we can go ahead. We can get these two connected up to this, like a so. We get this guy brought way out there, like that. Get that connected there. That connected there. Fantastic. That guy should turn right on right now. And bada bing, bada boom this guy doing concrete wonderful all right so that is gonna go ahead and start making our concrete wonderful do i have storage i organization storage unit i do indeed fantastic let's go ahead and get this guy locked in right there and boom concrete is done okay whoo that feels good uh now we need a smelter which we have wonderful wonderful i'm gonna put this guy like right next to this thing i <laughs> i don't need to spend my time with conveyor belts. We're going to end up moving everything anyways, getting it put on foundations, trying to get things nice and neat like. That looks good. Will the... Do I have enough? Oh, darn it. That's going the wrong way. That's not going to work. There we go. Let's try that. Boom. Good to go. Can we put a power pole out right here? That'd be fantastic. And then can I connect you? Three of four. Oofed. You know what? Let's get another one. Let's get another power pole on this side over here just to make sure we're good. Connect that there, that there and that there all right cool oh looking good this is gonna be making iron ingots fantastic now i would like to throw a constructor i can throw a constructor yes please all right so we'll throw that there 
Now, iron rods take metal ingots. So I don't know if I want to, I don't know if I want to go ahead and have it start making plates or if I want to have it start making metal rods. Let's go with, I actually kind of want this one to split off and go into two separate deals. You know what? Let's just have it start making plates right now. That's fine. We need a hundred plates anyways. Ooh, rods would be good though too, because we need those for screws. That's fine. That's fine. Now, can I make another auto miner? I'm close. Can I make another constructor? I can. Actually, I can make two more constructors. But we don't have any, we don't have a splitter yet. So we can't quite do that. You know what? We're going to go ahead. We're just going to, we're just going to get copper done too. Just knock it out right now. Be done with it. All right, let's get this guy unlocked. Boom, push the magic red button. I like it. Field research unlocked. The ma'am. <gasps> Ooh, an upgraded tool belt as well as an object scanner and beacons. Very nice. All right. So what do we need for this guy? Go away. We need five reinforced plates some cables and some oh, that's not bad. That is not bad at all. Okay. So what do we need for that? Plates and screws that are yeah. Plates and screws. That's super easy. Superly duperly easy. Ooh, do I have any raw metal? I don't have any raw metal. And this is all being, <laughs> this is all being turned directly into plates. So we definitely need to get a, uh, we need to get a splitter in there. I don't think we have logistic. No. Okay. And we're good for the ma'am. All right. So this is no longer part of this place, which is kind of weird. Cause it looks a little empty now. So, you know, I don't, I don't really, I don't really know, <laughs> but we'll go ahead and throw that guy there. Now this should be different. All right. So alien organisms. Uh, we can go ahead. We can research biomass. Oh, we get biomass for researching that alien organs. So you can see there's more of a skill tree now. So we have Caterium. So let's go ahead. Let's grab some of the stuff that we had. Uh, we have Caterium. We have some of that uh, berries, this, that a slug. Maybe I, you know, I don't really know. Let's find out. So alien organs. We have that research time. Start research takes three seconds and that's going to unlock the next New skill recipe. tree, which is structure analysis. Okay. Do we have any of those? We don't have that. Okay. Kateria, we New have that. So let's go ahead and search that. So what's that going to unlock for us? At least use a new node in a tree to begin new analysis. Uh, Katerium ingot. So we have to research 50. Can't afford. Did I not grab flower petals? Apparently not. Nutrients. All right. Let's start the research on this guy. Oh, that's three minutes. What? <laughs> Can I start research on this? No, <laughs> darn it. This was three seconds. We could have got power shards. Uh, okay. So that is completely new. New research tree, new research stuff. I like that it's mobile. So you can have like multiple if you really want. <gasps> Wait a second. You can have more than one. We, we could have more than one. Oh, guys, hold everything. All right. Let's say I wanted a, uh, I wanted a second ma'am. Can I bring one in here? Encroaching others clearance. Oh, now I feel like we should have put them this way. Oh, that is fantastic. Cause now I can choose power slugs. Get this guy knocked out. Oh, other research. Are you serious? Okay. Well, never mind, guys. That is a big old negative on that one. You cannot have multiples. Darn. I was really hoping you could have multiples. And like this one was like researching one. You could have another one researching another one. That would be epic. Okay. All right. So did we get anything else from that hub space elevator? I don't think so. Craft bench. You know, I probably should go ahead and make those, but you know what? They're, they're not new. They're not exciting. All right. Nothing else new. Let's see. What is the next thing we're going to work on? Uh, logistics conveyor splitter. That's kind of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Copper sheet. Smart plating. Interesting. Chainsaw out solid biofield. The most energy efficient form of solid biomass. I'm guessing we use this in, in the the burners, the biomass burners. Oh, I really want these. The awesome sink in the awesome shop because guess what? Microtransactions are a thing. Just kidding. There's no microtransactions. You turn items into tickets to then unlock other stuff. So um, I definitely want to check that out as well. Uh, How bad is that? That's not that bad. That is not the worst thing ever to make. Now, can I make logistics mark two conveyor belt awesome sink? No, it doesn't look like I can make any more burners. Can I make any more biomass burners? Oh, I can actually guess. <laughs> guess what? Because we need to get another line on here. Ooh, but you know what? For that, I need logistics, which means I need the splitter. We need that now. All right, we're going to do it. There's that one. 150 plating. Ouch. Ouch. That hurts. And we have those. Let's go grab some more plates. We can knock out this guy, get some logistics, get a splitter on here. Get some more things being made at the same time. Oh my gosh. Voila. Let's press the button. Fantastic. 
logistics Monster unlocked reached. Conveyor lift, now merge, splitter, split, merger. That's what I want. Okay. So I don't think we have enough power right now to support a whole nother system is the issue, but we can make another biomass burner. And that's exactly what we're going to do. We're just going to go ahead and throw this guy probably like right here for now. And how are these guys doing? 87. Okay. So this can be restocked. I do want to get this, but I think this guy might be super handy. So we're going to go ahead and select that one. Once the drop pod returns, I do already have some biomass at the ready. Lucky for us, there's actually quite a few. There's there's a lot of wood here under these trees. So there's there's actually quite a few, uh, quite a bit of, of resources like readily available. But now I got to connect this to, yep. That was my worry. Let's get you connected to there instead. And then let's go ahead and just top these guys off. Do that one first, then that one. All right. Now we should be able to put throw a splitter on this belt throw another smelter in oh you know what we're gonna need another power pole my gosh we're gonna need so much power it's absolutely ridiculous okay so there's that and then production let's get a smelter in here i don't have enough what am i out of rods oh the rods <laughs> the rods are my vein of my existence right now I cannot wait to get those things automated. All right, so smelter. We'll go ahead and throw this guy right here. We're gonna need a constructor. Oh, thank goodness we had this stuff for it. I don't know if I can handle that one or not. Let's get it, come on, line up, line up. You're so close. Boom, got it, okay. Uh, and then can I get another organizational deal? I can indeed. Get that guy on there, fantastic. And let's get these boys connected up, shall we? Boom, boom. Looks good. Go ahead and do iron ingots on that one and rods on that one. My gosh, finally. <laughs> Those rods are such a pain. They're such a pain. Okay, so do we have any more on this one? We have one more on that one. Let's go ahead and use that one first. That one next. And then we need a splitter logistics. Let's get a conveyor splitter. We're just going to go ahead and throw it right there. Get a belt. Sure. That looks good. And we'll throw it right there. It can look sloppy right now. It's fine. It's just a minor thing. Okay. So we have rods going, which means we can get make screws. Hey, look at our thing should be coming back. Where's it at? Wait, what? Where's the, where's the launchy boy at? Should be right here. Launchy boy. Oh, apparently it's gone. All right. So now we can start filling this in. Ugh, that's terrible. That's, that's interesting. That's very interesting. How's the ma'am doing? Are you done? You're done. Wonderful. Analysis of pale berries complete. Please choose your next nude. Fantastic. New Power slugs. Grab that now. guy. Three seconds. Wonderful. Analysis of that. Please choose your next nude. To da -da -da. Slug scanning. Yellow power shards. Overclock reduction. Oh, what? Cost is 20 of those? yellow slug and then okay but we should be able to craft ourselves up some of the power shards yes wonderful okay so we have two of those now let's see uh what machine do we need wait wasn't there something like a a thing that would tell us like what our machines were producing i don't see anything yet we also have to make a space elevator what do we need for that concrete plating rods and copper wire that is not bad at all all right, so this thing's starting to get backed up. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna, th oh, I can't overclock it. I was gonna throw a slug in here and speed this guy up. But apparently, <laughs> apparently that's not a thing for us quite yet. That's kind of terrible. So we're gonna have to do some more researchy stuff. Fantastic, Uh, still just waiting on screws. And that'll let us do some obstacle clearing. What else do we have over here? What else can we research? All right, can't research those yet. Alien organs, Caterium. I don't have any Caterium right now. I do have some flowers. I guess we could do some of those. Uh, nutrients, what? Nutrient mixture? Oh my gosh, that, <laughs> that requires all kinds of things. Uh, let's start the research on these guys, I guess. Oh, that's a three minute one too? Oh my gosh, this is terrible. Absolutely terrible. You know, it's kind of crazy. It takes 20 power shards just to unlock the overclocking production. So that's 20 slugs that you have to find that are just going to get literally sent to nothing to start with. Oh, that is terrible. Maybe that's why they're like so easy to get now. I don't know. Maybe they increase the rates of all of them. I have no idea. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to grab up a whole bunch of this biomass. 
and like i said there's a ton of wood right here and wood is by far like the best biomass because it's just it it has such a good like transfer rate or whatever uh so that is fantastic but let's go you know what? let's go grab a slug let's go grab another slug shall we oh hello there guy i need your meat anyways so yeah come after me ha 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 beat it nerd what is this green power slug all right we need yellows we need all kinds of colors uh there's one over there oh there's a stinky biome right there let's go for it oh how deep is this water oh not too bad hello mr green slug i'll take you as well thank you thank you there's another one right there my gosh these things are absolutely everywhere yeah there is so much biomass here you know i would almost argue that this place is actually better than the starting place just because of how much wood there is there's so much wood on the ground you don't have to do anything to collect it it's all yours it's just yours for the takings for your yours for the pickings uh hello guy oh yeah no you're getting wrecked son yeah you're done you're done can't even handle it green power slug ah oh, i need like yellow ones and stuff just imagine the factories you can build in here i mean it's not flat but like if you just build up just a little bit you could build a huge factory right here it's gonna be amazing there is a slug over there in the distance i was trying to see if there's any more i see one right there right there i see maybe one over there oh and the sliding works downhill this is amazing it's just like it's just like apex legends people <gasps> oh it's a yellow oh it's a big boy though oh it's a big boy let's go ahead and get that ready let's eat some food here all right we're going after it me and you man it is me and you holy shamolies what did you just do all okay i gotta i gotta give you all of the shocks oh man shock you in the butt shock you in the butt and a punch and a shock and a punch and the shock maybe this won't kill him oh we got him ha <laughs> ha beat it nerd all right yellow power slug thank you so much i will thank you all right oh i can see one up there i can see one up there yeah there's so much biomass here gosh this might this might be better than the forest areas there's another slug over there yeah they definitely increased the number of slugs there's one there there's one there there's one there there's one over there there's so many slugs now they're absolutely everywhere and i absolutely love it come here mr slug man the only thing that kind of stinks is that you have to like use 12 oh, there's a purple one that's a purple slug that guy right there is worth like five after the first one. Oh, it's in a bad area never mind we'll leave that one alone <laughs> we'll come back later for you guys i really want that purple slug i really want it i wonder how much damage we would actually take if we ran up there and grabbed it real quick we we might not take a lot but we might also die i don't know should we try it let's go for it okay we're gonna go as quickly as we can to grab the slug quickly grab the slug oh yeah we're way good way good look at that we got five regular green slugs we got one yellow and one purple slug ha <laughs> ha slug hunting at its finest all right so we got all these slugs can we go ahead and uh do some research uh analysis of nut is complete fantastic now slug scanning can i select you oh my gosh you can't just scan the slug anymore it requires other stuff and i bet you this one right here is the purple one holy moly okay well you know what we'll just go ahead and hang on to those for now not worth it yet uh the green ones we can go ahead and break down into uh power shards but gosh we need so many Ugh, it's awful <laughs> it's it's different it's not awful it's just different uh so those eight are gonna go to basically nothing that's that's absolutely fantastic so uh let's see what else was there and we now have the screws let's go ahead and press the button fantastic now the reason i pressed the button for this was because maximum efficiency i want to see what the new biofuel stuff the solid biomass so it's biomass but it okay so let's go ahead and craft up some of these i'm curious solid bio they look like the little planters you know the, the, the little planter pucks that you get if you want to like start growing seeds you know in those like the springtime like you'd like water them and it's like soil that's what it looks like so i want to make some of these oh my gosh they take forever to craft though 
so i've got to say i think this one right here if you're going to be using biomass or biofuel for a lot of things then i would say that it would be who of you to probably set up a system to make this now my guess would be probably a storage unit just make the the regular biomass by yourself just by hand and then throw that into a storage unit to have it go through a um a fabricator deal and then have it go into another storage because like these take 10 hits per four which is insane now the chainsaw might run off of this which is kind of weird because like the chainsaw is something we just unlocked but Typically, the chainsaw requires fuel, like a biofuel kind of thing. So I'm curious if it runs off a solid biofuel. I don't know. Actually, you know what? We have it unlocked. Oh, you know what? We don't have it built, though. We do not have it built. And then let's see. Alien organs. Can we? Oh, we only have seven of those. But this guy. All right, let's research that one real quick and then confirm. And then what does it need? Probably 10. Oh, no, only three. Let's start the research on that guy. That only takes three seconds as well. Okay, so now what do we have? What is this thing? Mechanical medical inhaler. What? Inflated pocket dimension, five inventory slots. Ooh, this is cool. Wait, hold on. Are those, what are those? What are those? Is that, is that the mycelia? Possibly. Oh, that's neato. All right, so let's take a peek here. Six seconds for every one biomass. That's not terrible what happens if we do this 15 seconds for everyone so hold on a second this gives us six per one but it takes eight of these to craft four so it's it's better by a little bit it's better by a little bit because if you think about it one puck is two biomass which would be 12 seconds so i mean i guess but the time that you have to put in to make it is it worth two more seconds? I don't know. I don't know. That might be ha that might be something that has to be that has to be buffed. You know, I don't really know. But there is alternate recipes down there for uh, alien meat. One like the 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 smaller guys is one for a hundred biomass, which isn't too bad. And then the bigger guys is one for two hundred. That's not bad either. But still, ooh big oof you know like i don't know i don't know i don't know about that one let's see if the chainsaw could run off the this stuff now oh you know what that actually reminds me we need to make some uh production stuff we got to make these guys so there's a crafting bench and an equipment workshop let's go ahead and turn that guy around uh right there that looks good now what do we need for this chainsaw not afford recipe okay so we can get that stuff super easy let's go grab that real quick all right let's get a chainsaw in here i'm curious to see if we can run off the biomass the solid biofuel stuff let's see okay put that in there chainsaw will you run off of oh it says it does it does run off the pucks interesting all right so how much should we get from that 57 wood and 200 something leaves. That's not bad. That's not bad. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay. All right. This guy's worth it. It looks like it might be two, two strokes per deal. Not bad. Okay. All right. I like it. I approve of that. That is very nice. <laughs> very nice indeed. How much uh, concrete? Oh God. It's super slow. Uh, is it because it's backed up, actually? And it's a 45 per minute. How much is this one actually putting out? Is this only putting out 30? I think it is because it's impure. Yeah, so this guy needs overclocked. But we can't do that until we have a whole bunch of other expensives. <laughs> My gosh. But that right there is going to end episode one. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Again, we're, uh, we're going to continue playing this. Hopefully, you guys enjoy that. And... If you want to catch a live stream of it, I highly recommend going over to twitch.tv slash zwoodgaming as we stream every Sunday on Twitch, and it's a good time. It's fun. It's fantastically exciting, momentous occasions every single time. But uh, thank you guys so much. Hopefully you have a wonderful week, and I will see you in the next episode.